Greetings and welcome to eCraft. In this video, I will show an IoT application using an Arduino UNO board, a BMP to 80 atmospheric temperature and pressure sensor, and an HC05 Bluetooth module. You could refer to another video on this channel to start setting up Arduino UNO with the HC05 and installing an app on your mobile device. The components I have used for this experiment are shown. We are going to use the example sketch to read data from the DF Robot BMP to AT library. If you do not have the library already installed, you need to install this first. The code uses two libraries, namely DF Robot underscore BMP to AT and wire libraries. The first one helps with providing APIs to initialize and read data from the BMP to AT sensor. The wire library provides the APIs to operate I2C interface for sending and receiving data between devices and sensors. The first function displays the most recent status of the sensor, allowing for an assessment of its health and identification of any issues. In the setup function, the serial port is initialized to operate at a baud rate of 115 to 00, and the BMP sensor is reset and initialized. If any faults are detected with the BMP sensor, error messages and the most recent sensor status will be printed. In the loop function, temperature, pressure and the calculated altitude are read from the sensor and sent through the serial port to display on the serial monitor. To make some changes to the code, we need to include the software serial library. After that, we will create an object called soft serial with the RX and TX pins assigned to pin numbers 8 and 7 respectively on the Arduino UNO. It's important to remember that the TX of the HC05 should be connected to pin 8 on the Arduino UNO, while the RX pin of the HC05 should be connected to pin 7 of the UNO. The TX and RX data connections between the Bluetooth module and Arduino UNO are crossed to allow simultaneous transmission and reception of data between the two devices, enabling full duplex communication. The next week would be done in the loop function. Instead of sending the sensor data to the PC, the same will be sent over the UART data pin 7 of Arduino UNO controlled by the software serial functions. In the loop function, the section displaying sensor data on the serial monitor will be commented out, and instead, a portion of the code will be copied and modified to change serial to soft serial. I am going to edit the code and save the sketch with a different name. I forgot to initialize the soft serial object in the setup function. I will fix this by adding it in. The soft serial port will be set to work at a baud rate of 9600. Now that all modifications have been made, I will proceed to compile the sketch to ensure there are no errors. 
Once the code has been successfully compiled, I will upload the sketch onto the Arduino UNO. It is crucial to remember to disconnect power from the HC05 module before uploading the program onto the Arduino. Failure to do so may result in an error during uploading. Once the upload is finished, connect the VCC connection of the HC05 to the 5V pin of the Arduino UNO. Then, open the Bluetooth Serial app on your mobile device. There is another video on this channel explaining how to install and connect the app to the Arduino. Once you have the app open, connect to the HC05 device. You will see sensor data posted in the app every 2 seconds. This is how you can wirelessly access and read sensor data on a mobile device using Bluetooth. Thank you for watching.